and welcome to Jet 98 News. I'm Spencer Ernst. There's a recent study out that suggests that teens today are not getting the licenses as often as 20 years ago. This is our first story. In a recent study by the Federal Highway Commission, there is a drop in teens not getting their license today than 25 years ago. But why would there be such a drop? Well, here's what a few students had to say. Um, teenagers are afraid to get their licenses because the accident um, rate has gone up since teenagers get their license because they get into more accidents. So they get scared of driving by themselves. The kids probably don't get their licenses because they're scared of all the different costs they have to pay. And if they crash, and they're in trouble. To get more insight on the statistic, we interviewed Ms. Horman, Lindbergh's driver's ed teacher. I think the statistics are lower now than they were 30 years ago because of the fact that we have graduated driver license law. There's more distracted drivers, aggressive driving. Kids are facing more challenges out on the roads than they were years ago. And uh, driver education definitely helps alleviate that fear. So, and Lindbergh has committed 50 years of driver education and that shows that we're committed as a community to make the road safer for you guys. And finally, has this study affected Limburg? We talked to Dr. Helms on the subject. I don't think it's I don't think it's uh, affected Limburg locally, uh, but you know all the statistics uh, say that uh, most of the accidents occur for uh, for uh, people under the age of 19 years old. In fact, some of the most serious accidents are occurring at 16 years, 17 years old, which is a concern. And so we want to keep kids safe. And I think that's what the legislatures are looking at, it's trying to legislate some safety issues for, for kids. That's a good thing. Statistically, teenagers have not been in their license, not only because of the cost, but also the fear factor. We have programs just like RAD and Driver's Ed to educate students to be a safer driver. I'm Amy Loyette, Jet 98 News. Thanks, Amy. And now here's our daily announcements rundown for today. NHS is holding a special canned food drive, so if you can, please turn in canned food to their organization. RAD is having a special community-wide remembrance of the victims who related in alcohol car accidents. So if you can, please give the victims' names to Mrs. Horman for a special remembrance. Hey, and if you like the Grinch movie, but in a different language, that is, the French Club is holding the Grinch movie after school today in the auditorium. Now, you don't need to know French to see it, but it might be fun to learn. Your books today are still costing $60, but if you wait after winter break, they'll cost you $70, so buy them as soon as you can. If you want any winter spirit wear, last chance to get it is today at the athletic office. March Van is also holding the food drive, which will end December 13th. And finally, detentions. You only have four days left to, to um, serve these detentions, so serve them as soon as possible. And now for sports. We see a special segment on the boys' varsity and JV wrestling team. <laughs> All right, a couple things I hate. I hate the term reload. I hate the term rebuild. Rebuild is when a coach thinks his team sucks and doesn't matter. Good. Reload's arrogant. I'll use neither of those. Here's the deal. We've got a lot of kids. We've got good talent. We lack some experience. But my expectations are for the guys to work very hard, compete even harder. And if all that happens and we have any luck at all, it'll be a good year. If all that happens and we don't have a good year, fire the coach. Slime. I'm Joe Price. Greg Fowler. Just driving. Then well, we got the Flyer Classic tomorrow. Gym 3. 9 o'clock. <laughs> got a young team. Me there. Fun. Alright, I just want to remind you again, Boys Wrestling Flyers Classic is tomorrow at 9 a.m. in Gym 3. Other athletic events, girls basketball against Hazelwood West is today at 5 o'clock and JV plays at 7 o'clock. Freshman boys basketball is today at 4 o'clock against Marquette. And freshman girls basketball is today at 4 o'clock but at Marquette. I'm Spencer Ernst for Jet 98 News. We'll see you next Wednesday.